Hi, I'm Mike Stanton, and this is a BAM Credit Insights video about Rowan University in New Jersey, which is selling approximately $190 million of loan revenue bonds. The bonds are split into two series. One series will be sold by the Gloucester County Improvement Authority, totaling $175 million, while the remainder will be sold by the Camden County Improvement Authority. I'm here with A.J. Kelly from BAM's uh, Higher Education Group to discuss the transaction. The bonds will be rated AA with a stable outlook from S&P Global Ratings due to Build America Mutual's guarantee and carry underlying ratings of A from S&P and A2 from Moody's Investor Service. AJ, thanks for taking some time to be here. Of course, thanks for having me. So let's start off talking about Rowan generally. Tell us about the uh, university. Sure, so Rowan University is located in southern New Jersey. It's in between Philadelphia and Atlantic City. The flagship campus is located in Glassboro, New Jersey. With respect to programming, Rowan offers a diverse array of programs, almost 100 bachelor's degrees with a particular focus on STEM areas. In fall of 2023, Rowan enrolled just over 21,000 students, and that student population has been fairly stable. We've seen selectivity and applications both trending upwards. And with respect to this issue, uh, roughly half of the bond proceeds will be used to construct the new Schreiber School of Medicine. It's the first school of its kind in New Jersey, while the remaining proceeds will be used to finance various capital projects and refinance some of the university's existing debt. Great, so let's start uh, diving into this issue in particular. So let's start with the security. How will the bonds be repaid? Sure, so the bonds will be a general obligation of Rowan University, payable from any legally available funds, which includes state appropriations, tuition fee revenues, grants, and revenues from auxiliary enterprises. And so you're taking a look really at the, the kind of the whole operations of the university. What's the scale? What, what's the size of uh, revenues? Sure, yeah, it's the financial scale here is pretty substantial. The operating budget totals about $647 million in 2024. Those operating revenues have grown by about 4% per year on average over the past five years. Um, and in addition to the growth, we've also seen the revenue base become more diverse as rev uh, research revenues in addition to research income have been increasing. And so as you take a look at the affordability of the debt, how does that revenue base line up with the de uh, debt obligations? So the university should generate sufficient revenues to satisfy its debt obligations, even if the revenues don't continue to grow. Uh, our analysis of Ro Rowan's debt profile, including maximum annual debt service, takes into account these bonds, other existing debt, and future plan borrowings. Great. Well, thanks for your time, AJ, and thanks for watching. For more information about BAM or our analysis of this credit, please email us at creditinsights at buildamerica.com.